Last week I was starting to put this rear tailgate together. I got kind of the paneling put together. I also need some side frames here. I think this one is the original cleat that was on this rear tailgate. This one was added. If we look closely, just got a slightly rounded edge on them. They're not square like this one was. And then we have a pretty sharp bevel on the ends, on both ends. So after the same treatment as I do on all my other wood, this is what I'm going to use for my cleats. So they should fit in about like so. The old ones come in three inches from the edge and they're nailed from the back side. And that's why I used a new piece here so that the nails have something good and solid to fasten to.
Well, that pretty much completes rebuilding this old tailgate. I'll have to figure out what I'm going to close that hasp with. Maybe it was a wooden peg. I don't know. We'll have to talk about that. But interesting to find this little key on the inside of that tailgate frame. This is kind of a mystery key. Who knows what it goes to? It was hanging on this little nail, and the head of this nail won't go through the hole in the key. So I think through all the years of its moving and deterioration, that's why this key was still there. I have no idea what this was or what it fit, but I'm going to stick it right back where it was. It was on this inside frame, right in the center, about an inch and a half down. There's actually kind of an old hole there. I wonder if that would fit in there. I think it might just fit right there. Remember it was about like so, and then this was bent up. Keep it in place. That key will stay there for another who knows how long. It's one of those things that just show up. It's kind of a mystery key. Who knows what it belonged to. I'm sure the lock is probably long gone. A little inconvenient to get to inside this door. But that's where it lived. That's where it'll stay. Appreciate you following along. Thanks for watching.